When NASA's Orion capsule lifts off from the Kennedy Space Center just a few years from now, it'll mark a new era in American spaceflight and the culmination of millions of hours of meticulous work like this. These UNLV engineering students are testing the quality of an adhesive on composite panels that will be used for the walls and flooring inside the spacecraft as part of a five-year contract with Lockheed Martin worth up to five million dollars. They're also using the latest 3D technology to give Lockheed a way to precisely cut holes in the surface of the capsule within thousands of an inch. I've always been interested in rockets, you know, space, stuff like that. Uh, I've always kind of wanted to do something to help out with NASA, so this is pretty much just, you know, my dream come true. For the team, including grad student Victor Carbajal and engineering graduate Louis Demola, it's a real-world experience for an out-of-this-world mission. You spend all day in class and in the library working on homework, and then you can come into the lab and actually apply that stuff and see it, what those numbers are actually doing, and seeing the theoretical lineup with projects that are going beyond Earth. Engineering Department Chair Brendan O'Toole is heading up the team and says helping take Americans to Mars is a rare opportunity. And I've had an interest in that. My research way back when I was younger was structures, composite structures for aircraft. And so getting back to doing work for the space program was exciting. Grad student Adam Gentle says he hopes UNLV's contribution to Orion and the Artemis missions will also help UNLV's profile in the aerospace industry and bring more research projects like this to future engineering students. Yeah, I hope it brings in other other programs and other other companies to show that hey we can do this just like any other big university from around the country or around the world. Like it, it gives us a little bit more validity if we're working with companies like Lock Lockheed Martin. UNLV still has about two and a half years left on the Lockheed Martin contract so they're expecting to get more work before the Orion space capsule finally takes off and carries Americans to the frontier of Mars. Back to you. Incredible.